preparations are underway in Milwaukee as the city prepares to host the Republican National Convention at Pfizer Forum next year. Well, the Republican Party will select its nominee for the 2024 presidential election. Today, Action 2 News got a sneak peek of the venue. Brittany Smith joins us now in the newsroom with a glimpse of the potential impact it will have on the state. Brittany. Bill and Cammie, next summer, more than 45,000 people are expected to attend the Na Republican National Convention in Milwaukee, which means planning is well underway to prepare for the big event. In July, in July of next year, eyes across the world will hone in on the Pfizer Forum in Milwaukee as the United States Republican Party selects nominees for president and vice president for the 2024 election. When we walked in to this arena as the site selection committee and took a look around and realized what our convention might look like, we were, our breath was taken away. RNC chairwoman Ann Hathaway says the Midwest hospitality certainly helped draw them in. I would love to tell you that it was the cheese the beer, the food. But of more significance, the importance Wisconsin plays in the political sphere. It is a battleground state, and the convention in Wisconsin has the potential to energize the base and help Republicans win back the White House. We have 23 staff on the ground full time, seven of which are Wisconsinites, myself included, and we are honored to do that. You know, choosing Wisconsin and hiring local was intentional. The local hires understand this state politically, can build bridges, and have had a fantastic impact. Dickens says the number one priority of the convention is to launch their candidate to victory, but she says there's work to be done in the meantime. You know, what can we do short term and long term for our party uh, and what wins can we get along the way in this process? So number one is that local economic impact. We want to put our Republican priorities uh, forward of supporting small businesses and empowering small businesses and being a part of the community. The four day event is expected to bring the region about $200 million, a priority for Wisconsin native Reince Priebus. It's all about Milwaukee. It's all about the economic impact for the state of Wisconsin, uh, my home state, my backyard growing up in Kenosha. Couldn't be prouder to be here welcoming all of you to what will be the greatest convention that I can remember here, right here in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. It really shines a spotlight uh, on our state as a destination as a whole, you know, especially in two different ways when we look at these two events. You have the NFL draft that is, you know, a lot of leisure travelers coming and making their vacation. And then the ability for the state to host an event the size of a Republican National Convention. Um, you know, if we can host a draft and we can host uh, a Republican National Convention here in Wisconsin, what can't we host? Meisner says it's too early to tell if Northeast Wisconsin will be part of someone's travel plans for the RNC. About a month later, the Democratic National Convention will also be held along the shores of Lake Michigan in Chicago. Experts say the venue choices for both parties tells us the Midwest could be a clear target for the upcoming 2024 presidential election. Cammie.